The sauce says it all, and so does their cause. Some local vets are selling their homemade barbecue sauce to raise money for wounded warriors. News 10's Brittany Earls explains how these vets lost touch and were reunited through their passion for barbecue. Danny Parkhill and Carl Johnson have been friends since 1987. Danny needed some guidance at the time, and that's how we became involved with each other. <laughs> they fought in Desert Storm together, but along the way, the two vets lost touch. Twelve years later, Carl found Danny cooking up some barbecue and liked what he tasted. He's like, dude, tell me about this sauce. He said, you've got to market this sauce. And I said, well, you know, it's only money, and I'd kind of laugh it off. It's hysterical. It's hysterical, yeah. Carl immediately knew Danny had something special. I was having real trouble just, just trying to keep up because everything that I'd put on the shelf, people would come in and buy. Carl convinced Danny to market his sauces. The two long lost vets created Two Vets Barbecue. They started small, selling it any way they could. Well, I'd sell it at the hotel where I was staying <laughs> to other guests, you know, <laughs> just like out of the trunk of the car, sort of, you know. Like. Eventually, Danny and Carl turned to Baszler's, a local grocery store helping out their local vets. So anything, you know, local and especially, you know, from one of our customers like Carl is, uh, we, we like to support and help out as much as possible. And if you purchase two vets barbecue sauce here at Baszler's, 10% of the proceeds is given to wounded warriors. The least we can do is give back some of our good fortune to them. If we can contribute part of what we're doing to the wounded warrior project and we can make a difference in those guys, it's a little better. Two friends reunited through a passion for barbecue and a passion to give back to their fallen brothers. In Terre Haute with photojournalist John Tim, Brittany Earl. If you don't have any bomb left in your diggity, this will put it there. News 10. <laughs> I like that. Carl and Danny say they have already donated $500 toward the Wounded Warriors. For more information on Two Vets Barbecue, head over to WTHITV.com and click on this story.